Guys, I need to do this. I need to make a full-on apology video. I haven't got any fake tears on me at the moment, but this is this is real. This is real from the heart. I didn't read something. And I died yesterday. I mean, guys, come on. What do you expect? Watching one of my videos, do you expect me to do anything right? I mean, come on, guys. Come on. So, I want to bring in a new segment to my videos called Casual Comments, where I pick a comment and casually read it out to you because of how awesome it is. And today's one is Jonas. So Jonas said, because I was whinging about the frames, it would be cool if you could put different frames on your five heroes. Everyone can see and then flex six different frames at once. I love the frames, but you can only use one at a time and it's a pain, always changing them. Now, I agree with that incredibly. So Jonas, brilliant comment and that would be an awesome thing as well. So what did I do wrong yesterday, which basically shocked the world? Like, guys, cause you, you got, I know my views only say like 500, but it's glitched and I actually do get 5 million views per video. So when all those 5 million people watched my video yesterday, the world like shook. I could feel it trembling under my feet because I versus swine cough or coughs as friends are out to call them coughs because I versed coughs and I didn't realize after all enemies use five skills kills them instantly why why is that a skill so I'm gonna go and fight Pluton because he's easy and I'm a noob that's awful that's awful Oh, come on. That's awful. Eh, I'll take that one. So let's go. Obviously, guys, I did get a little bit roasted by Robert F as well. You can simulate the challenge before. But I know for a fact Pluton's not difficult, so I'm not going to bother. Um, I'm going to go for one big damage, okay? One big damage. Like, you can't really go wrong with this team, guys. So let's go. Let's go. Let's see where we can get to with this team here. Again, you can't particularly go wrong with this team, so it is all normally... Oh, no, take off auto. Oh, we didn't get a follow-up there. That's a bit of a letdown. Didn't get a follow-up there either. I can use that still round one. More damage. Lovely. Okay, cool. I'm not going to use a special yet. Let's wait for it to go round. Lovely. Lovely. I, I, I generally think Supersonic is a little bit underrated, guys. Supersonic is a banging character. Lovely. Huge hits there. So I'm doing the Guild Proud now, guys. I'm finally doing the Guild Proud. Big hit. Come on, follow up. Yes! Boof, boof. Lovely. Oh, okay. And what I like is that the core keeps supersonic and um, uh, triple stuff early in life as well. Another follow up. I'm going to see if I can hold out on a using her special and his special. Because King should ding in the sec. King should go in a sec. Quick. Yes, again. Okay, lovely. Bring down the damage. Chop. Great, come on, get a follow up again. Ah, oh, let down. Tush, tush. Oof, oof, oof. Oh. Boys, that is a mad one. 910 million damage to Pluto. That is ridiculous. That is absolutely madness. Now, I did have a lot of people, again, getting annoyed at me, which... It's standard but there, there was there was quite a um it, it was a good argument actually and i'm curious to bring this to you guys's attention actually for the sake of this video um i had a lot of people arguing with me in here and they were saying that no you shouldn't buy the hero selector chest you should buy the breakthrough shards now okay if you buy this crate you get 100 tt and TT is quite important to get to level 
seven so she so you could rinse through story mode so i actually personally think i am going to go through for the breakthrough shards just because like yes it's great to get characters but i've got enough characters leveled up that i'd really like to get tt to plus seven to really bring that forward but if i'm going to give you one piece of advice guys and again i do want i want to hear your guys' opinions i i want to gauge in this video which one you guys think is the best because i see lots of people argue about it on the facebook group that i run on my discord on my youtube that they just can't decide which one's better because basically you could take away two to three of these crates a week with this event going on you know as long as all guild do their attacks and you do your free attacks every day or you could potentially save up and take away one of those now, they will certainly be bringing this... Now, for everybody who says it's an exclusive event, it isn't. We're talking about Rotus, Rotus, um, One Punch Man here. This event will come back every single event now. Or maybe every other. So, you're not going to have to worry about this never coming back. So, it, it is going to be... I, I can almost guarantee you it's going to be a long time thing. So choose wisely, but if you are going to choose one, get the character shards or get the breakthrough shards. Don't buy anything else, whatever you do, because that would be a waste. So I think I will go for breakthrough shards, because if I grab the breakthrough shards, because at the moment, I, I don't really care about this battle pass. I don't care about it. Um, so what I might do this time instead is treat myself to the login card instead of the um hero pass i normally tend to buy myself one thing per event and i think that's what i'm going to go for because that's really going to be the kind of bigger push in getting me those breakthrough shards and that will increase me further in the game over basically anything else so i don't even know how much this is actually i'm just just gonna just gonna buy it I want to be able to grab as much TT as physically possible here. So guys, again, do make sure you are using App Gallery. You can see here, guys, that I've got 21 points. So that's just because I bought a few in-app purchases over the past few events. So click that top link in the description, guys. Get yourself some free cash back. Get yourself some free coupons and save yourself some money. I... I can't stress I can't stress this enough guys. I'm here to play games ter terribly, but I do like to try and save you a bit of money. So do it. So let, let's get this pass here guys, right? And let's just see. So I'm basically getting this for free off cash back. So let's do this. Great. Okay, lovely. So now I've got this pass. I'm never going to add up the amount of money I spent on this game. Great. So now I've got this pass, and over the next few days, five days, I'll grab my 200 tokens. Now, I'm quite excited. Oh, I should have actually got a load of tokens from here as well. 12 in there as well. One more in there. Okay, great. So I, I'm quite excited, really, because I get awful things from the spins every time. But I'm quite excited to push that towards um, actually seeing if I can get... You know, I'm going to have 300 spins, right? Which means I can take away quite a lot of TT's breakthrough shards. About 300 spins, will I get a jackpot? Now, I've seen a lot of people with this event talking about, like, how... Wait a minute. Oh, four days. I was like, that's not right. So I got one there, and I've got four days to grab the next one. And then the event ends in five days. Okay. <laughs> I literally thought I just got mugged off then. Okay, so anyway, I'm going to be able to do around 330-odd summons, so I'm quite excited for that. And obviously, all of this, I'm just going to use on TT, so I want to get to plus 7, basically. So I I have paid my way forward there, and I apologise to everyone who's going to call me a noob for that, but you know how it is, guys. And obviously, when you do that as well, I'll be doing this in my live stream on Sunday, guys, the carnival. So I'm, I'm excited for that. Make sure you tune on my live stream. Isn't there a... Um... Ah, yeah, then I get two of these as well, which is nice. Boom. Boom. Awesome. 
That's why I kind of like it as well. Ah, oh, five in there as well. Great. And again, I don't care about Beast King. I really don't. I, I, I want RNG. I want to make a bit of, you know, people love it when I do my RNG content. So I'm going to go through from there. But anyway, guys, the, the main point of this video was I want to get everybody talking in the comments. Please, guys, be nice. It's, it's a game. Do you know what I mean? There's no wrong or right answer. You buy what you want and you get on with your life. If you want me to give you some <laughs> advice. But guys, do comment down below and let me know what you think is the best thing to pick. Is it going to be the hero selected chest or is it going to be the limit breakthrough shards? And I'll see you beauties in the next one. <laughs> <sighs> guys for any of you who've hung around for this long which i swapped my awful webcam just to say this message to you guys you're all absolute legends you all mean the absolute world to me guys i love what i do here i'm gonna keep doing it i'm gonna keep playing games badly for your for your enjoyment <laughs> i don't know what i'm talking about i'll see you guys in the next one bad webcam out.